But there was, there was a, a coat shop at Baddingwood, Murray's, but I don't remember it now, it was before my time. And, and <coughs> I believe there worked an awful lot of pe people in it, you know, there was, there was wheel lights and <coughs> body makers and a poster and a painter. Now, there's some of the people that their parents worked in it around the town getting up, you know. <coughs> And I have some of the tools that were used in that place. And I think why, why there's so many coaches still around Ballymore is, is, you know, because the coat shop was there at one time. One man done the wheels and the body better done the body. And, you know, everyone had their own job. And actually, done, done the own Some of those Murrays now that had that around the town for years afterwards after it closed. And there was one of them, he was a coach painter now, and he always painted, he painted the shop fronts, and he was a great sign writer who has done that. You know, the signs of the show. And there's people that came to that workshop working, and the, all the people are here in the town since then. Like, you know, people belong to them. They, they, because a lot of people came from the north that time, at that kind of coach work. Holsters and... and, and uh, Coach builders mostly came from either England or, or the north of Ireland. You know, there are people, there are people that are around this town yet now. People belong to them a couple of generations later. Murray's clothes, some of them went working with, with other people that had worked. So that kept on the, the coach building and the wheel. Like when that one closed, people didn't, that was working, it didn't move away. Some of them stayed on. You know, I worked in, we'd say, some regions now, there was two men that worked in, 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 in the coach shop. <coughs> this always was a good town for caves and traps and the coat. You know, okay. Tropical Reading was the same, there was a place in Tropical And I suppose there was one in boy. But that's all. There was no other kind of transport, only that. And Valley Moor, when the people had come into Mass, and up at the top of the rock there now, You'd, you'd often see between side cars and, and traps. You'd see about 20 of them. That thing, nearly every public house had a stable on the stable their horses. You know, by mass was. Well, that was it now. I think we were no bakery or nothing. The only works have been it now. But during the war, there was no houses made in, and, and that's here at the workshop. And even when, when the houses were we built, all the windows and doors and everything were also made in the works. And furniture, everything. Who often made a set of bed, me set of dresser. Kind of, you done everything. We had to do it. Everything comes in a pack now.